Everybody comes home for Christmas time. It's a family thing to do. Well, here we are on Christmas Day, and it is a half hour easy run today, and thankfully, it's also a special park run day, so we're heading off to Dulwich Park Run to go and run with our chums. Happy Christmas. Happy Christmas. There's a party going on at home. Don't stop without me. All our friends are coming. There's loads and loads of people. So Christmas Park Run done, and I've done my personal best. So nice seeing so many people, so Merry many kids. Christmas. <laughs> and so many Santa hats, including one behind me. Well done, Dan, on your park run today. Thank you very much, Murray. Thank you. So it's Boxing Day. Turkey has been eaten, wine has been drunk, apple pie has been eaten. So we're going to uh, do our usual route down through Clapham Common, down to Battersea Park, and with any luck, the coffee shop at the end will be open. <laughs> There's Murray running way ahead of me. I don't know if it's Christmas or what, but I'm really not feeling it today. Listening to a bit of Kim Wilde, singing what I think is a new song, Candy Crush. Just thinking of the cake at the end of the run. Coming up to the final half a mile now of what has not been a very enjoyable run, if I'm honest. Hoping I can power through. It's just past seven in the morning. And getting ready for a tempo run. I find it makes me feel really unfit, so it makes me feel really demoralized. Uh, the upside is, of course, that it does have a massive effect on your fitness. Cup and common looks beautiful today. It's all misty. Oh, I feel like Kate Bush. I've literally just stopped in the middle of a fast pace, and I never do that. Yesterday was difficult, today is difficult. I think I must have put on weight or something over Christmas. Not fun. And I'm meant to be a fast tempo run. I think I'm a bit slow at the moment. So I'm going to speed up. So that's the tempo run done. Didn't go at all well. <sighs> My run keeper has gone a bit strange. About a third of the way through, I just ran out of steam. So I took a rest for a second uh, and then just continued, but doing a steady run. <sighs> Don't get over ambitious. Take it by small steps. <sighs> or else you run out of steam. <laughs> And we're off for our final park run of the year. Um, I did my personal best the other day. Don't we all know it? Yeah. What do you think you're going to do, Dan? Um, I don't know. I'm a little bit nervous. My past two runs have been... Oops, sorry. My past two runs haven't been brilliant. I'm not expecting a lot. I think my ambition today is just to enjoy it. Thank you ever so much to the volunteers who came forward this week. So that's uh, Saturday done. Got nowhere near a PB. And uh, now it's about uh, 20 past 10. Time to go to bed, because it's an eight mile long run tomorrow. Important to get lots of sleep. So I had a spot of porridge for breakfast with a little bit of uh, jam. So having that about half an hour before we go running. And about to do eight miles, which seems quite far for week two. Psychologically, eight miles suddenly feels a, a lot more than six miles. It, I think that's probably a lot to do with the fact that we'll now be running for over an hour. We're about 20 seconds of starting running. Perfect music. This charming man has just come on. Seems a perfect song for a rainy Sunday run. A mile and a half in. My ankle's a little sore today, so I'm not pushing it. A little bit worried about it. Coming up to Battersea Bridge now. One of the best things about running through London is running over the bridges across the Thames. Always beautiful. There's Murray overtaking me. No! It's lovely running across Battersea Bridge. A 
we there yet? No. <laughs> Engine curveball, thought Dan was taking us round Battersea Park, but he's heading towards the power station. Running through Nine Elms now. Just hit the six mile mark. Two miles to go. So we're now entering new distance territory for this training cycle. Behind me there is the American Embassy that Mr. Trump hates so much. About one hour 17 in. If we've planned this correctly, there'll be a coffee shop and a flat white at the end of it. Eight miles done, did it. End of week two. It's fantastic to kind of feel getting back on form today, all ready to start week three next week.